have a fist be love or in my stomach. Because yeah. I know the God we yes, serve. Awesome. Yes, sir. That's a good feeling. Yes, sir. No, it does make sense. They're trying to take you off an instrument. Why? Because they're refusing your service. Why? You have I to don't have know. Re eggs. You have no, to you have don't. Why. Any, yes, you any, do. any business Sir, or what has the different. right to refuse. This is my help. I know my rights. Okay. I know my rights. I know them. Okay, so you want to sit here until 2.30 and then, yeah, and 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 then EMS will unhook you and you, and you can go. That's fine. And then I'm going to go home. Okay. Peacefully like I'll be. But if I say don't touch me, don't, that's my right. And I said it calmly. And then you try to come over there, I'm going to touch you. No, you're not. I, I didn't said, say that. Sir, not you. You're talking about the situation. Oh. You're not going to touch me. You can't violate somebody's rights. I, and then you're going to tell me don't hit her? Don't touch me. You hear me saying don't touch okay. me. Don't, you don't have to get worked up. I'm right here. I'm you hear me saying what? don't touch me. Okay. How would you feel if somebody did that to you, sir? Would you be sitting here calmly? I've well, been I wouldn't sitting put myself calmly. in that position. But I've been, I don't, there's no reason why I'm in this because you've seen my demeanor. Yeah, they're asking you to end your treatment and leave, and you're refusing there's, to do so. Because there's no reason, and I need my treatment. Like, you have no reason. But they turned it off. That's fine. Uh, somebody else will touch me. They're not going to touch me. Okay. I don't understand how y'all take this stuff so lightly, sir. You seem like me, and I'm not seeing you. You mean I take it lightly? Not you. I'm just trying to resolve the issue. That's what I'm saying. Not, sir, this is serious. This is my life. Right. And so because I'm an advocate for my life. No, I'm an advocate for your life, too, and I want you to get the right, treatment, right. but you're just not working with them. Sir, why would, I'm not. I'm not going to comply with silliness. Did they just call medics for that patient you guys are out there with? Do they do yeah, they did. She's refusing to let the nurses touch her, so we're going to have EMS on her. Copy, I assume she's secure then for them. I couldn't copy you because of background noise. Is it seen secure for them? Yep, we'll be standing by waiting for them. It's secure. They're almost here. Down the way. Yeah, I just, I really don't want you to get in there and get hurt. I know. Okay, yeah. I know, but just the thing is, like, they're not trained to take her off. We could walk her through it. If, we could walk them through it if they're okay with it. But. They're pretty good dudes. They'll yeah. 439. They'll help us out the best they can. Yeah. So, I feel bad that everybody's having to get involved in this. Well, you said they're good. We'll figure it out. Probably be at 142, 14 South Haven. You'll be contacting Phil Stein. He said he had a trailer stolen, also a, a log splitter. I believe it's someone across the street, and he sounded like he was going to go over there and cause a disturbance. I told him to just wait until all officers got there. 14214 South 71 Highway. Correction, South Haven at 14. I don't think I've ever been here. Really? Usually it's pretty calm. I've been here for 23 years. I don't think I've ever been in here. Yeah. Usually, I mean, EMS is in here a lot, like the ambulances, so. but...
yeah, usually we don't really have like patient issues. So what is it uh, called? A stent? What's in? Uh, um, a uh, port? Yeah, like a, we call it a dial catheter. I'm sure they'll know. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can educate them. I mean, I'm sure they, I know they've been here, like they've seen it, but we usually all have them already off the machine and ready to go, but she's not getting her blood back or anything because it's going to be clotted because it's been alarming. So all we have to do is just flush the lumens, cap it, and wrap it up and she'll be good to go. I just don't know about after that. Like, if she's going to go home. Yeah, Pleasantly. Hopefully. She said she's going to sit there until 2.30, till her time's up, and then she's going to let them take it out and leave. So we got six minutes. So what's that machine do when it takes the blood? It just filters the toxins and removes fluid. Hmm. It's amazing it can do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is it your boss? She's like a risk manager. So like Does she know you want to be a mermaid? I want to be a mermaid. The police officer. Is yours up there? What do you want to do? No, I'm not here. Oh, but you're looking at that. Oh, okay. So I want to be just a few dressing gentlemen with two of them. And what do you think? Where are you putting the patient? Where are you putting the patient on there? Oh, there they are. Yeah. Okay. You know what we have to do? I haven't even started. So if you're not here, where are you? I'm at Blue Ridge in Raytown, off 63rd Street. This used to be her clinic. Yeah. And you chose to move over there? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I grew up over there. I oh, you did? No, we've had a call the police over there. We have homeless people that hang out outside the clinic. So it's like right by Sherwin-Williams. So we have a patient here that's kind of indifferent. Okay. She's kind of not really happy with the staff. She don't want to touch them. They've tried to disconnect her from the instrument so she can leave. She okay. won't allow them to. She assault, assaults them. She's agreed to let you guys disconnect it, but I don't know if you guys know how because it's... No, you don't. We can't. Or actually you can't? We cannot. Okay. You, you can't flush lumens? Or anything? I mean, I can, but I can't touch your guys' devices. Okay. We're not going to, I mean, we won't, we're okay. under not giving her so a blood we, back. We're just flushing the lumen, just flush tapping it, and then wrapping it with gauze. Like, that's it. I mean, are you pulling out the lines and all that stuff, or what do you guys want? No, who, we just need, she's over here. F you, gentlemen. Thanks, sir.
if I say it, don't touch me, don't touch me. I understand that. That's okay. my right. right. And if you come at me and touch me, and okay. if you say so, something who, after I say it, don't okay. touch let me, me. Let me ask you this. So I'm not going to Who hooked you up to the mother? Or who hooked you up to the mother? She's not here. She's not here anymore? Okay. So what's the situation that happened that is throwing this up? Sir. Situation. I don't understand why all this is happening. But what, what happened is because she left the thing. There was this write up and the whole situation was around. And there was a little bit of a problem. Fletcher Residence so covers your front door. 6601138 Street and Fletcher. She didn't want to talk about it. She was your FA. You were supposed to talk about that situation. That's your job. And, you and, and so she gets mad. I have it recorded. I have it recorded. Mm -hmm. She gets mad and says, I'm now, I even asked her. 3441, 3441. She said, no, you were not. So I had that. And so she goes and she calls people. They're going around asking people if I was disturbing. Nobody went to them. I'm sitting here watching everything. Nobody said I'm disturbing anybody because I'm not loud. But I, this is my right to talk on the phone about anything I want to. I can talk about what I want to. So let me ask you this. Has your dialysis finished? No. Okay. That, that's what I'm saying. It's 2.30. Okay. Are yeah, yeah, you taking me out now? 2.30. At 2.30? That's my okay. ending time. And so, there's no reason for me to be taken off. There had no reason okay. to stop my so treatment. Stop in your treatment is really there's Can no I ask you, just because of the escalation of behavior, just Policy the thing is, is that this is a my book. They said they can walk through. They the ones, I don't know why they I don't have a doctor's order. I don't know why they can't walk through their doctor. Okay, I have my own doctor pro uh, protocol that I'm allowed to do certain things. Okay. They told me this, okay. that EFS, which I don't know why you call, is going to put me And I don't understand it. She's not because I asked her not to. You're going to okay. keep on coming at me? I okay. said no. I understand that. I understand that. Okay. okay. I get that. Now, they're the ones that are in charge of these machines, okay. okay? They're the ones that can take you off the machine. So why did they tell me you were going to do that? I don't know. I don't either. Okay. I don't understand. The thing is, is that I have to call my medical director okay. and ask him. He's not going to allow me to. Okay. Because it's about, okay. okay? Can you allow them to take it off? She's not. It's not me. But anybody else in this room that can just flush your room and wrap you up and so why are you telling me that when you're making this so sick? Okay, no, no, it's not. No, 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 Okay. They can do blood transfusions. I can't do blood transfusions. I can pay blood, but I can't do that. But they don't, they don't, they don't know that. Okay. So they call us, and then we inform them of what we can and can't. Okay. And that's plain and simple. They just don't know some of the stuff, and that's okay. They can call us, and we can come in. We can inform them what we can and can't do, and then we go from there. Okay. So if there is somebody else here. Or would you like me to call and check on that? I'm going to grab my ring. Sorry to invite you to the show. Oh, you're fine. Uh, uh, I'm to try to
you mind if she explains, the patient explains it, or we explain it to you and you explain it to her what we're doing when we take her off? He's been here the entire time.